I wanted to talk today about the four P's of trusts. Now, trusts is like one of those things for some people that's over there somewhere instead of over here. And I just want to bring it over here, meaning in your world, into your world. So if you haven't examined trust, if you haven't investigated trust, if you haven't studied trust, it's, in my opinion, one of the most powerful entities on the planet. In fact, it pre, pre is a predecessor of other entities such as LLCs, corporations, and limited partnerships. And it exists today and many of the world's families, not just the United States of America, use trusts. And it's because they have discovered, they have investigated, and they have aligned with the benefits of trust. Now, the benefits of trust, I've identified over 30 benefits that you can get with trust that you cannot get with any other entity. Not a corporation, not an LLC, not a limited partnership. Only trust can provide these. And so I thought it'd be great if I could give you and gift you uh, some information about that. So the four P's, privacy. Well, one of the great things in life is that everybody doesn't know what you own. And in fact, in our legal society that we have here in the States, it can actually be a negative for people to discover what you own because they might want to get what you own. And when you use the benefits of trust, one of the byproducts and one of the benefits is simple home, simple ownership of the trust of the asset, you might be a beneficiary of that. Your family might be a beneficiary of that. Another entity might be a beneficiary of that. There's many different things that can happen, let's say below the waterline in terms of who the beneficiary can be. But one of the great things is that the world doesn't have to know. Only you and your trustee knows that. Now there's a lot more to that story. I'm going to give you an opportunity to learn more. And I'm in fact, I'm going to give you a free book. I'm going to give you a free book while we're together today. This is trusts create privacy, avoid probate, protect everything. It's by me. And listen, there are so many good things. In fact, I, I put it into a booklet. It's not a full treatise on trust, but at least if you're investigating trust, if you're interested in trust, it will give you some more insight into trust and what they do and how they operate. And one of the great things I put in here is some of the benefits of trust. In fact, let me find that page. I was going to tell you how many benefits I've put into this booklet as well. Um, and you know, if you, if you actually take advantage of this now, by the way, you can go to maximum asset shield.com forward slash book for your own copy. And it's free of charge and you don't have to, to buy anything. So there's benefits of trust. Oh my gosh. I've got a whole bunch of them here that I outlined while, uh, while I was putting together this booklet. So, Get your own copy of that and advance yourself in your knowledge. Now, the second P that I want to talk about is probate avoidance. Now, an LLC, a corporation, and a limited partnership will not avoid probate. Holding property in your own name will not avoid probate. So what happens is now your family has to deal with, and hopefully their intention would be to to be your spokesperson, so to speak, after your death. But why in the world burden your family with that? Instead, why not do it in, in, in advance? When you place a property into trust, you're literally saying in the trust, who gets it? So you can be the primary beneficiary of the trust and you can have a successor beneficiary or successor beneficiaries of that trust. Now, meaning the asset that's in that trust now can flow to the people or person that you want to receive that, or even another entity or a charity or whomever you want to receive that can be named in that trust as the beneficiary. Now, here's what's cool about that. No need for attorneys, no need for delay, no need for expense. There is so many 
wonderful things that can happen when you take advantage of trust. I really encourage you to, to deep dive into the conversation because it's something very powerful. And in fact, I've got an event coming up. It's a one day, it's only for $1 and I'm going to get an, deep dive into the trust to spend a couple of hours going deeper into what you need to know and how you need to know it because I'm just doing this whole one day for $1. And I want to give you all, not only those four P's, but all those benefits of trust, break it down for you, give you some real solid information that is actionable on your part. Now I've talked about privacy. I've talked about probate avoidance. I want to talk about protection. Don't you think you're going to be better off, better off if you do not have your assets in your own name. In this country, it only costs a couple of hundred dollars for somebody to file a lawsuit. Now they can tie you up. They can tie you up for a very long period of time and that can be uh, assisted and you can file protect, you can have protections because you can have each property in its own trust and you can have various different beneficiaries of those trusts. A lot of great things can happen when you take advantage of trust and definitely give you a great deal of protection. Listen, my opinion, don't have anything in your name. Don't have anything in your name because you're the one they're coming after. And if they don't have access to those assets, that's a good day. And finally profits that you can take advantage of some of the benefits of trusts. And in fact, it's built into some of the laws that could even give you the opportunity. And in fact, do give you the opportunity to transfer your own property into trust and not have the lender call the loan due. So they don't consider it to be a due upon sale when you transfer your property to your own trust. Now I've got a lot more to say about that. I encourage you take advantage of the one day that I've coming up. Now, listen, this is going to be July the 10th. This is a one day event. We're going to start at 10 o'clock AM Eastern time. We're going to go to six o'clock PM Eastern. Hey, and we're even going to have a bonus session and what we call a happy hour after that. So just give you a great opportunity to learn all day long. I'm not only doing trusts. I'm also going to be focusing on finding the buyers before you buy. 